Hey there, everybody. P. Pardo here from Sea of Tranquility. Welcome to pick 30 of my favorite 31 rock and pop albums of the 70s countdown, which we're going to be doing each and every day here in the month of August. These are the rock albums, right? Or the pop albums, right? Not the prog albums, not the southern rock albums, not the uh, heavy rock, hard rock, heavy metal albums, not the jazz albums. Just the albums that we kind of call rock albums. And again, some of these albums might rock pretty hard. Yeah, this one rocks a bit, right? This one today, this is uh, for my pick number 30. This is the second album from this British band. It was released April 26, 1974. Recorded at Audio, or Audio, Audio International Studios in London, as well as uh, at Vizian Studios, also in London. We've heard that in Vizian Studios quite a bit over the last couple of months. Produced by Phil Wayneman for RCA Records. I'm talking about Sweet Fanny Adams from Sweet, right? It's like sometimes they call it Sweet Fanny Adams, or is it just Fanny Adams by Sweet? Whatever it is, I think it's Sweet Fanny Adams, the full title of the album. Uh, but yeah, the very cool cover, right? This is uh, the band Sweet, who are, you know, started out as kind of like a bubblegum pop band, then they turn kind of glam kind of hard rock still lots of pop very very unique band very cool sound a lot of really good albums i would say this is probably my usually my favorite album they have two three albums that generally are rise to the top for me but this one generally is my favorite uh brian Connolly, lead vocals steve priest bass guitar lead and backing vocals andy scott guitars lead and backing vocals and mick tucker drums and backing vocals so what do we got on this particular album well you've got uh a little song called set me free which kicks things off right set me free is a really good rocking song it's been covered by many many other rock and hard rock and metal bands over the years but set me free is just a good uh hard charging but yet very melodic song lots of fun you got heartbreak today you got some glammy stuff on here like i said got some pop stuff got some hard rock stuff heartbreak today is a fun song then you got no you don't really cool rocker right there really love no you don't in fact pat benatar and her band did a really good cover of that many many years later cool you got rebel rouser lots of fun Again, 1974, this whole kind of glam and rock thing coming together. Very sparkly sound, but lots of good cranking guitars and really good vocals. And you got all the guys singing, you know, which is really good vocally. Very, very rich sound. Uh, you got Peppermint Twist. That's a fun song. Over on side two, you got Sweet F.A., right? Great song. Might be the hardest rocking song on the album. Excellent song. Then you got Restless, followed by Into the Night also terrific and then the fun closer acdc right acdc did a little band from australia perhaps get their name from that song i don't know maybe not acdc is a term anyway right good song anyway um lots of other songs recorded around this time if you get the uh like the reissue they throw all sorts of things on here like blockbuster and ballroom blitz and hellraiser because it's complicated history when it comes to sweet right you have a couple of their albums had different releases in the states compared to uh the uk so sometimes you got these songs that songs right and you know desolation boulevard which came later had two completely different versions because of course this album uh did not get released over here so they incorporated some of these songs it's complicated it's complicated but still uh the original album the album awesome stuff i uh, really like this one a lot so uh let's talk about the charting positions shall we australia number 33 austria number six finland number nine germany number two norway number 12 sweden number four and the uk charts number 27 so of course nothing here in the states and in the uk this is a gold album hundred thousand units sold pretty cool so yeah, uh, a really fun album. Dig this one a lot. I know we got lots of Sweet fans here on the channel, so uh, let's hear what you guys think about Sweet Fanny Adams 
as well as your pick for today, day 30. And visit us on the web at www.seatranquility.org. We're on Facebook, we're on YouTube, all together, all the damn time. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and click on that notification bell to get alerted of all of our content as it posts. And please do hit the like button before you leave. Also down below, we got the links to our Ko-Fi page for channel donations, as well as our merch page. So thanks in advance for all your support. They were greatly appreciated. And uh, yeah, once again, Sweet is my pick for today. Great songs. If you never listened to this album, go listen to Set Me Free. Now You Don't. Sweet F.A. Into the Night. All really good songs. Rebel Rousers. All really good. Good, Just good, fun, party, rocking album. Kind of glammy, kind of hard rocking. It's like a little bit of everything, right? Good stuff. Good hooks. The whole nine yards. So uh, there you have it. We'll see you tomorrow with pick number 29. Till then, I'm Pete Pardo. Thanks for watching, everybody. Please. Stay tuned for lots of uh, new album reviews coming up at you today. So should have a whole handful of them for you, at least. So uh, please stay tuned and watch those. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow with my next pick in my favorite 31 rock and pop album, albums of the 70s countdown. Till then, I'm Pete Pardo. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you soon. Bye-bye.